All right, welcome, special guests, friends and all. Uh, this is Bobby Gaines, otherwise known as Chaos Blur. I pointed the wrong way again. You, you guys know where the graphic is. Otherwise known as Chaos Blur, here with the fourth ever episode of Sunday Night Sonic, which is this thing I do. See, it's usually on Sunday nights, and I usually play a Sonic game. That's exactly what we're going to do here today. I got the OG, the Sega Dreamcast here today with the superior version of Sonic Adventure, not the ported version of GameCube. Let's not even talk about that. But we got the OG Sonic Adventure here. We're going to play some Tales Story, uh, Tales Adventure, if you will. And if we have time, maybe we'll check out Knuckles Story, too, because this game is not as long as I remember it being, uh, Sonic Adventure. Like, when I was a kid, I thought this was like a 30-hour game or something. No, you could beat, like, all six stories in, like, maybe five or six hours. <laughs> I realized that when I played Sonic Story in, like, two hours and... Sonic has by far the longest story in this game. Uh, right now, I just gotta make sure the audio isn't, like, deafening, because I know this game has kind of crazy loud audio at times. That's all right. I'll just project. Project over it. So we're gonna go ahead here, and... Of course, I got many great save files. Uh, let's see. Is the Elgato being a dick again? It looks like the Elgato's being a dick again. Hold on. We'll find out. Right after this. Come on. Oh, yeah, that's being hell of a dick. That's gonna... If anyone's gonna be a dick during my streams, it's gonna be me. Also, I appreciate you checking in, uh... Jeff Achu. How you doing today? How's the family? How's the weather? Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, how long have you known this, uh... Booby Goons? And, uh... What brings you to tonight's stream... You excited for Sonic Frontiers? I have to say, I surprisingly kind of am. I wouldn't have said that a few months ago, but uh, they've they've got me, as Sega usually does, like any bad lover or good lover, I guess, depending on how you look at it. Sega's got me interested in what they have to offer, but whether or not that pays off, well, that remains to be seen. Kind of like my Elgato. Sometimes they're on, sometimes they're off. Right now, they seem to be off. The name of one of my bots tonight is All Roads Lead to Healing. That's actually the name of one of the users in the chat. If you are a real person, I apologize. I just find it hard to believe because, well, I just I get a lot of bots in my uh, chat. Which is fine with me, you know, but bots are people too. Just call me Bot the Games. The 
but don't. It sounds really awkward. All right, we seem to be working fine motion-wise. Just want to make sure, see if Sonic's running animation still working. That's good. Well, we're not going to be playing as the Blue Blur tonight. No, Chaos Blur will not be playing as the Blue Blur. We'll be playing as the Yellow Fellow. I, I literally just made that up. The Yellow Fellow, Tails. Playing Splatoon. Splatoon 3, which is so much different than the other ones. It literally looks like they just released the same game three times with Splatoon. Like, I'm not saying they didn't add anything. Getting my own... Well, you already have an ass. Why are they going to hand you another one? That doesn't seem very nice. Speaking of somebody with two things on their ass, uh, we got, um, got Tails here. Twirls. Twirls the Hedgehog. All systems go full speed ahead. This is great voice acting. Just like Call of Duty? Oh, are you bad at Call of Duty, too? I only play the zombie mode in Call of Duty. Uh -oh. I actually just started getting into Fall Guys, which is another multiplayer game entirely. Oh, crap. It's so realistic. I feel like I'm on the ship with them. Oh, that's true. That's true. And Call of Duty, I mean, they're just getting lazy now, because, I mean, like, there's a bunch of wars, like, in history and modern wars that they can do, but they just kind of keep doing the same thing over and over again. So I kind of enjoy the simplicity of Call of Duty zombies. Just shoot up a bunch of zombies. I can get down with that. Yeah, I'm going to make fun of a lot of graphical and sound things in this Dreamcast game a lot, but in all seriousness, this is like one of my favorite games of all time, so I can't really, you know, the stuff I do is more in jest than anything. And it was at that moment, Tails began to have strange feelings for Sonic. Although, were they really that strange? If you know Tails, probably not. Boy, you're lucky I saw you come down. I gotta say, the colors in this game are still brilliant. The Sonic colors. So wrong, like, it, it, still, it's I mean, I know the graphics are dated, like but like, I don't know, something about this cutscene really pops. Yeah, it's just that I'm testing a new prototype power supply. Yeah, and I'm probably a little biased. It's not fully compatible yet. The way they always just, like, kind of have their idle animations, like Tails, is just sitting there going, like... Like, and now, now Sonic, whoever's not talking, basically, just kind of, like, stands there and just barely moves. Like, I would almost rather they just stand there and do nothing. Oh, really? The Elgato's gonna do this crap on me again? Alright, well, too long, didn't read. Tails has a Chaos Emerald. He's gonna do some stuff with it. I assume most people who are watching the stream have already played Sonic Adventure. Let me see what I can do here. Yay, what a stream. It's funny because, like, it never glitches on my TV. It, it always looks fine on my TV. But then I look down at the stream and I'm like, oh, Tails is running at one frame a second. Which I know he's slower than Sonic, but he's not that slow. Actually, one of my friends was watching Sonic Movie 2 with me and, like, she didn't know, like, you know, much about Sonic. So, like, the, the scene where, like, Knuckles is chasing the police car and, like, he's almost catching up to them. He's like, I, she's like, I didn't think Knuckles was, like, as fast as Sonic. And, like, in the movie, he kind of is. Like, I, when I think about it, I mean, all those 2D games, or even the 3D games, like, they all move at a pretty similar speed, Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. I mean, Sonic may be a little, a little faster, but I don't know what I'm doing right now. I think there's an upgrade. I don't know if I can get to it yet, or I have to wait till later in the story. But I think there's an upgrade I can get for Tails, the anklet that makes him fly longer or whatever. I don't know if it's longer or faster or both, but Let's see if it's still where I remember it being. Visible walls, gotta love that. Camera stuck in the wall. Gotta love that. Okay, there used to be something in here. Yep, I see it. Ha ha! Who's played this game way too many times? This guy. There it is. This just makes the whole Look, game a lot it's easier. Jet it's jet Not that it's really that hard. Faster. Thank you, useless hint orb. Are you serious? Freaking Elgato's gonna do this. It's like the third time in like 
not even 10 minutes. I mean, I'm, I'm used to this a little bit, but I'm going to try a new approach here. It's basically the same approach, but in a different way. Ah, that was a loud USB noise I just heard. I think Frankie actually did this the other night on his stream. Oh, I'm sorry, Toaster Cartridge. I can't say that name. It's funny because they both use each other's real names in their streams. But when they're guests on my stream, they like, they deny their own name. Let's see if this works. If not, I'm going to be resetting this thing like every five minutes. Watch me have to switch to the GameCube version just because it might be more stable. I had to do this once when I played SA2 on Dreamcast, but it was like once. It was like in the middle of the game, I did it, we moved on from it. It was all good. But so far, I've had to already check this thing like three times. There will be Sunday Night Sonic. I don't care what I gotta play. Well, if it's Sonic 06, I might not be too happy. Okay, here we go. Let's go before Tails changes his mind. I like this game's running at. Actually, that might be the problem is that it doesn't run at 60 frames per second. It runs at 30 frames per second, but I don't think my own god can even handle 60 frames per second anyway, so it's a move point. Anyway, how's your Splatoon going? Other than getting your ass handed to you, which I guess is not a good way for it to be going. The train headed for the Mystic Ruins will be departing soon. Why does Tails need to take the train anyway? Can he just fly? This question been asked before, probably. See, I really am optimistic about Sonic Frontiers because I feel like it's going to bring back the aspect of a story. Like, why, you know... Like, every Sonic game has you running through levels, but this is going to be like, why are you running through the levels? Like, why are you trying to find these levels? Why are you trying to get, like, through the story? Like, so, I'm hoping, I could be wrong, but I'm hoping there is a really well-thought-out story. The fact that Ian Flynn is on the writing team has me well, cautiously optimistic. Well, well, if it isn't Sonic and Tails... It's Eggman! Look how they slightly alter the dialogue depending on who you play as. The most cunning scientific genius in the world! Yeah, right, Dr. Eggman. Enough! I've seen working on a master plan, but now it's time to put it to work! I am the Eggman, that's what I am. I am the Eggman, I got the master plan. Oh, that's not safe here, but whatever. Give me that Chaos Emerald, or else... You know, villains never finish that sentence. Oh, no, I lied, he actually does finish it here. He tells you what'll happen, or else... But unfortunately for him, this is not a very hard boss, so and there really is no hard way here. Mm. Listen to that Dreamcast disc tray whir. Chaos whir. One of the most overpowered Rumble Packs ever on the Dreamcast, by the way. Full systems, full power. I think I've asked you this before, Jeff Achoo, but do you actually have a Dreamcast? Like, I know you played the Sonic Adventure games, but, like, do you have an original Dreamcast? Or do you just play them, like, on PC or whatever? God damn it, I suck right now. Now, how do you not have a Dreamcast, man? I, I love my fucking Dreamcast. Systems, no, I don't. That's all good. He's not gonna get away with this. You know what I'm getting you for Christmas? I actually bought like three or four of my friends' Dreamcasts. I don't know why. I feel like it's like my civic duty to get people Dreamcasts. Uh, as, as a Sonic fan, especially in the late 90s, you, you had to have a Dreamcast. I still love this console, by the way. But we'll see more of that in Retro 50 coming uh, this, actually next week, next Sunday. Yeah! Next Sunday at 12, Retro 50. You might see some Dreamcast games in there. Yeah! Tails gets so excited. I did it, Sonic! You're so proud of me. What was Sonic doing during that whole battle anyway? Was he just standing there watching? Like, yeah, all right, whatever.
I was gonna say, I can't that skip these cutscenes if I wanted easy. to. Like, if you hit the start button, you Suck. can't skip them. Hey, he's magic. In SA2, you can. SA1 on Dreamcast, you can. SA1 on GameCube, you can. But that doesn't help us here. Chaos could use a little Not that I want to skip them. They're so campy, I have to watch them. Oh, Chaos. Actually, I do enjoy Chaos. I wouldn't mind seeing a Sonic Adventure uh, adaptation of the movies. Day. I know they're already skipping uh, SA2 spoilers. Oh, you would get like little metal pieces in him every time he got a Chaos Emerald, but that's how he would evolve. Like now he just has a little bit more of like plastic material in his arm. Oh, that's it. And I guess that's what happens. That's Chaos 1, who you never fight, by the way. All he needs is seven emeralds to become invincible. Then he will turn Station Square into rubble. Yeah, let's Along face it, Station Square, Square was never the highest quality city, city to begin with. It's like the new one in the Sonic. <laughs> you ready, Chaos? Let's go find the next Let's go telegraph our plan. I'll just notice they spelled emerald like they put they put a capital E in emerald like it was a proper noun. Like emerald. Like now, not even Chaos Emerald, although I know that's what they're talking about, but like, just the word Emerald was we in cap. We can't that monster get any bigger. It could get ugly. You're right. Chaos must be stopped. And he can be if we keep him away from more Emeralds, right? So what do you say, Sonic? Let's find the so, Chaos Emeralds So, I must crazy. admit that as a kid, I never knew where to go here. Whether I was playing a Sonic or Tails, like... The game doesn't really tell you that you have to go up here to get the wind key. Like, I had to look this up, because in the game, I'm just running around like, what am I supposed to chase Robotnik? I don't know where he went. Like, it, the game does not tell you where to go. Like, now I just kind of memorize where to go, but at the time, I'm like, I have no idea where to go. It doesn't even, like, show this thing. It's like, all right, let's go after Robotnik, but where? The key is floating. Whee! Okay. Stage one, Windy Valley. Let's go. Woohoo! Come on, Tails! Hooray! I do enjoy just skipping big chunks of the courses, Tails. Whoa, I am lost. Uh Well, his flying's gotta wear out at some point, right? Where's the track? Hey, hey, hey. Where's the track? This was not planned. Where am I going? Hurry up, Tails. Oh, I'm hella dead. What? He's not getting tired. Tails, take a break. Read a book. Where is the track? I am not making this up right now. There's nothing underneath me. What is going on? What the fuck? You made it. I met what am I, what? If I win this somehow. Holy crap. Are we rolling on this? I guess we are. Hey, hey, hey. Oh no. Oh crap. Oh, Sonic's winning. Sonic just got way to the fucking end. And I finally died. What did I just watch? That's going in a highlight. Hooray! I will fucking clip that myself. Alright, so don't do that, I guess. I don't know why the course never appeared below me again. That was fucking crazy. I didn't hate it, though. Whoa, okay, come on, oh, okay, whoa, okay, whoa, okay. Okay, now I'm afraid, I'm afraid to take any major shortcuts, major shortcuts, because, like, I don't know if the game's gonna, like, do what it's supposed to do and make ground appear under me. Hey, hey, hey. Sound effects aren't syncing up either, and that's just in the game right now. Whoopsie. Whoa! 
Okay, hold on. I can, I can save this. I can save this. Sonic's catching up, but I can still save this. Holy crap. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're so not good. Tails, what are you doing? Holy crap, Tails. Am I stoned right now? Like, what is going on? All right, I won. I don't know how, but I won. Holy hell, what was most of that? So that's one death for me that made no sense. I almost died again. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Tails, you're lucky you're alive. I don't know how you defied physics that many times. Again, the game doesn't really guide you where to go here. I just know from having played it before. The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. Kind of weirdos, tails encounters on this train. We'll never know. I'm something of a weirdo myself. It's kind of much easier this is with tails. You just kind of fly up and open the door with the, by doing that. But then instead of playing a cool pinball level, you got to play the garbage dump level, which I'm not even like joking. It's just a garbage dump. Hell. Although I do love this music. Oh, tail, fucking tail. Sonic got a freaking head start and a half. Like, he was already, like, halfway up the slope before I even started the course. Okay, this one was always a little tricky because you can't really do too many flying shortcuts on this map. It's basically enclosed. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. All right, Tails. Don't patronize me. Hooray! Actually, I'm Tails. I probably deserve it. All right, Tails. All right, Tails. I'm somehow still ahead. Oh, there's Sonic there. Wait, what? Oh, I got an extra life at least. Hey, hey, hey. When I need it, the rate I'm going. See you later, Tails. I'm literally right here, Sonic. All right, Tails. Oh, this is not a very long level. You made like the it. one time that I can use my flight to my advantage here. Yeah! Oh, yeah, I'm going to beat the story that early. The rate I'm going. That wasn't too bad. It was all right. Yeah, maybe that discount. Ah, oh, yeah. Let's uh, go again. All right. This is how we do it. Ooh, the ice stone. We can use that in the ice cave in the other place. Oh, that's right. Robotnik's got to do some stuff first. I oh, could just like kill them here, but no. What's that? The chaos emerald. Oh shit! Get away from me! Ah, oh, damn it, Robotnik! God damn it! I highly doubt Robotnik cares if I get a good night's sleep. Well, I guess it was still nice of him to say nighty night. Wasn't needed, but it was nice. Hey, just be chilling uh, there like Sonic, what? Sonic, what happened to the Chaos Emerald? Uh, well, not one of them. But the other, but the other one's, one's safe. safe. He must be getting desperate. 
Now the emerald count is two to one, and Eggman's winning. It really is. Let's get a move on. It'll get even worse in a little bit. But you didn't hear from me. The train headed for the Mystic Ruins will be departing soon. Nobody asked me like what this giant blue rock is that I just brought in. They're like, oh yeah, that looks whatever. Just bring it in. Bring it in, I will. It'd be funny if I played the Zelda noise instead of that, like doo -doo 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 -doo, or whatever, whatever that noise is. The ice stone. It looks like a thing I can use. So let's use it right now. The key is floating. Time for snowboarding. Yeah, that's right. I said it. Come on, Tails. Find the emerald before Sonic. This one is a little arbitrary because there really aren't any shortcuts to take here. It's just staying ahead of Sonic, I guess. It's not like an accelerator button on the uh, snowboard. As long as I don't like get stuck on a rock or something, it should be fine. I know there's a couple of tricks you can do on the ramps to give you a boost. Later, Sonic. Aha! Aha! Whee! Whoa! Hey, oh! Woohoo! Oh, sh I almost always miss that one. That's like really a good shortcut to get though, if you get it. Apparently I did not. Hey, hey, hey. We're just barely win this, but I did win it. They all count as W's in my book. There. That wasn't too bad. Did I do that? That's what it should say. It should be like, did I do that? He really did do that. Mystic Ruins Adventure Field. Here we go. The train headed for a Ooh, Knuckles. Speaking of Sonic hey, movie too. What's, What's up? up, Knuckles? Wow. Oh no. What are you doing, Knuckles? Yeah, Knuckles, what are you doing? Don't mess with me now. 
just hand over the emeralds you have. Who really says the emeralds and not the pieces of the Master Emerald? I feel like that would no save a lot of confusion. Way, then where would the fun in that be? Wow, I didn't have to do anything. I... Oh no. Give it your best oh shoot, he actually moved. Oh, all right. I don't think I've ever died on this. Oh, he's no. dead. Or at least mildly stunned. Oh, no. Oh, no. Whoa, Whoa what a realistic oh, angle. Ooh, Robotnik. I do enjoy the fucking Robotnik. He really does. You two are bumbling idiots. You know that. I do miss this voice actor for a bot. I think that was great. Hey, those are the chaos the emeralds. Chaos emeralds. I don't care about those. You are so easily tricked. All I did was wait for you to bring it to me. What the heck is he talking about anyway? Oh, he, we know what he's talking about. Don't you realize when you've been tricked? Tricked. No one makes a fool out of I mean, except for Botnik, like, every single right. time. But other than that, yeah, you're you're pretty foolproof, four. Knuckles. Count them. Four. Way too many emeralds. I summon chaos. Come I summon four. Jinzo in attack position. Ooh, there's chaos. Chaos 2 now. God damn it, I do hate when he eats the emeralds. This is just not our day. Oh no! It's changing again! We gotta stop this fast. Yeah, well, good luck with that. Chaos 4 might actually be, like, my least favorite fight of all of them. Like, just in terms of the Chaos fights. Like, it's just... It's very random and repetitive. Just kind of wait around for them. It's not like a hard fight, it's just... Yeah. What it's what it is. I sold my 45 rings from the last level. Watch out. Still watch out. Oh shoot, an attack. I think I can fly over it. Hey. -oh. Whoa, splashy. Where is it? Where is he? Here he is. Bonk. Oh, jeez. Oh, Alright. Oh. Bonk. One hit to go. Whoa, an attack. One an attack it might have been. Whoa. Anybody ever play Sonic Shuffle other than me? I actually kind of like Sonic Shuffle. Maybe I'll do that for an episode one of these days. Right now, though. For Zonk. He's way too excited about that. But hey, whatever gets him through the night. It's alright. It's alright. Hey. Ooh, the egg carrier. I do enjoy the egg freaking carrier. Such a great cutscene. Not a bad little ship either. Squidward's father never hugged him. Isn't that sad? Yeah, I suppose that is rather sad. I don't know why I just thought of that. I be random like that. Behold my floating masterpiece, the egg carrier. Yeah, I just said that. 
Chaos. Chaos. In comparison to the power of chaos. Chaos, chaos word that is. I didn't know you spoke Italian. Do you? Not the egg carrier. Well, he's carrying many an egg. Actually, just one. Eggman. Egg McMahon. Yeah, for those of you keeping track, uh, Chaos is became Chaos 4. And uh, now we're about to go to the Sky Chase in one of my favorite scenes in Sonic history with the uh, tornado arising from the, uh, the hangar there. I have some unfinished business to take Knuckles making little vague references, which we may or may not get to see if we play Knuckles' story tonight, which remains to be seen. Come on! Come on! Let's get going, Sonic! Gorsh. Okay, but I can't read. Wait here for a second. Sonic, wait here for well, a this second. door just kind of opens itself. Oh, yeah. Bring on the tornado. Oh, that's a great moment. I'm such a nerd. All the people who say, like, ooh, Sonic had a bad transition to 3D. Like, I think this was, like, a perfect, like, first 3D game for Sonic. Like, it it had enough references to the old games while still being, like, a new story and everything. I mean, yeah, some of the gameplay hasn't aged great. But, I mean, for the time, like, it, it stood right there with other 3D platformers of its time, like Mario 64 or, like, Rayman 2, stuff like that. I don't know why Rayman 2 is my go-to, but my point just being, like, I don't know, this, this game feels like a new Sonic game, like, without, like, alienating people who like the original, I think. I'm not saying, like, I also don't think every 3D Sonic game is bad, either, like some people do, but, like, this game was, like, a masterpiece. Like, back when it came out, this game got, like, 9s and 10s for reviews, yet everybody goes, oh, Sonic was always bad in 3D. It's like, did you guys, like, fall asleep or something? They're the same assholes who gave it, like, a great review when it came out. And, like, yeah, I know all, like, 90s games kind of aged badly, but people don't say that about Mario 64. People still love that game, despite the bad camera and all the wonkiness there. Because it's Mario, it's a classic. <laughs> Yuck, Nintendo. Anyway. Back to the gameplay. Heck, this is almost like a little Star Fox 64 minigame. Like, even the side activities in this game are fun. That's something I'm hoping Sonic Frontiers has. I know they've already shown, like, the big the cat fishing minigame, which, you know, it is what it is. Probably something you can skip, but it might actually be decent on, like, playing the big the cat in this game. But, like, I hope there's other little side activities, maybe even, like, sky chase type of stuff that you can do in Sonic Frontiers to kind of break it up. But we'll see what happens. I'm, I'm optimistic. I feel like Frontiers is going to be one of those games, at least in terms of length, where it, it's going to feel like how this game felt to me the first time I played it. Like, when I first played this game, I thought this was, like, this massive game. It turns out you can beat it in, like, two hours. But, like, you know, this game, now that I'm in my 30s, you know, Frontiers taking 20 hours will be, like, the equivalent of this game taking two hours. Like, I'll be like, damn, that was actually a really long platformer. At least I'm hoping that's what I'll say. <laughs> and not be like, oh, it's over already? I mean, I've been waiting five years for the next new Sonic game. Technically longer than that, because I don't really count forces. Sonic Mania, in my opinion, is the last, like, great Sonic game, which was over five years ago. Hard to believe. August uh, 2017, that game came out. I can still remember Jeff Chu coming over to play it. The night it came out. We did it! Every time they say that, I have no idea what they mean. They're like, we did it. Like, you did what? Like, you, all you did was, like, take out some, like, enemies. Like, you didn't, like, destroy the ship or anything. Yeah, I mean, if I was Robotnik, I would do that, too. It's like, hey, let's just, like, use the big laser on them. Yeah! They're almost, like, excited about it. Yeah, we're going to serpentine to our death. Wow, 52%. That's a terrible percentage. Hey, we just got hit with a giant laser. Yeah! Cool, guys. Let's wipe out. <laughs> wipe out. Anyway. 
How's everybody's night going? Hopefully you're having a good one. Time for a sappy flashback that nobody asked for. Tails' only goal in life was to be like Sonic. And that's what was so sad about it. There's Sonic now. He's like, I'll never keep up with him. And he was right. But yeah, those of you who are as excited about Frontiers as I am, hopefully you'll tune in for the Midnight Stream, November 8th. I'll be playing Frontiers as soon as humanly possible. Cannot wait. But in the meantime, we got plenty of streams to come. we got Retro 50 coming next Sunday at 12 p.m. Of course, right now we're doing a little Sunday Night Sonic. Tails having a weird reflective moment right there in the middle of the woods. Or actually, I don't know. How they survived that crash is still beyond me. That dream brought back memories. That dream brought back happy I owe memories. I so much to Sonic. It's been 84 years. Sonic! Sonic! He's dead. Now he actually lands in Station Square. Spoilers. Hmm. Wonder where he went. He's dead. Sure hope he's alright. No, he's dead. The tornado's not powerful enough. The tornado's also, like, gone. If I'm going to get that egg carrier, I need to finish my prototype. Which means what? You need to get another emerald? I was going to say, you need a chaos emerald. Everything needs a chaos emerald. Have a problem opening the door? Get a chaos emerald. Not good in bed? Get a chaos emerald. Everything's solved with a chaos emerald. Oh, there. Hold on. Let me look at that idle animation again. He's just like... He's like so hyper. See, I already know where to go, but the first time I played this, I'm like, where the F am I supposed to go? So you go in here, and you spend an unrealistic amount of time getting lost in the woods. Or at least you would if you were, you know, a noob. Which I'm not, thankfully. But yeah, actually, this was kind of an open-world Sonic game at the time. I'm just gonna do this, because even though I could fly across half the woods, that's how you get lost. Come on, just, just jump down. Okay. See if I know what I'm doing here. Okay, I was going to say, don't let me get lost again. Red Chaos Emerald just sitting there. Froggy? He already ate a Chaos Emerald earlier. It's so weird. Like, just the fact that this goes into, like, some kind of sandboarding minigame, like... The sandboarding's fun, but it's like, why is this a thing? Like, we're just in a totally different area now. As far as I know, there's, like, no way to lose this. Like, you just kind of... Like, there's no hazards. You just go through the gates or whatever. Uh, I guess you could get hit by those, like, rock snakes or whatever. I think this song was actually used in one of the Sonic Racing games, like All-Stars or Team Sonic Racing in one of the desert levels. It's a pretty cool song. This, this little minigame doesn't last very long. Also, I do appreciate you checking out the stream tonight, Jeff, too. I know you're busy with stuff, work and stuff, and platooning and stuff. So. Nice to have you here. I know you're pretty much the only friend I have who's like a big Sonic fan, like I am. I might we have that in common. Yeah! Froggy's just hanging out in the middle of this oasis that just happened to be there. I never questioned it as a kid because I just thought it was cool to go snowboarding through the sand. Oops! I let the stove on! I do hate leaving the friggin' stove on. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! I thought I was in the desert! I've been doing too much weed again. Uh-oh! I wonder where I am! 
This was another area I got lost in. I was really not good at navigation as a kid. Well, I know there's a power-up in this area that I need to get. I don't know if I need to get it, but it would be nice to get it. This is not an area of the game I play very often, to be fair. Trolls in this game actually were pretty solid. Like, the characters, like, turn on a dime. Like, that's pretty nice. I also never realized, like, how expansive this little area is. Like, you can actually explore it pretty decently. There we go. You found the rhythm badge. I really to do did. continuous tail attacks, hold the action button down. Really we'll be doing that. Whee! This is your mind on crack. Oh, did I just make rings come out? All right, cool. This is your rings on crack. All right, now. I don't think. Uh, all right, I was gonna say I don't think I have to go this way, but I mean I will. I know I have to watch to call, talk to her father or some crap. Nope, this is not the right way. to call on her father. Oh, she's literally right there. The servers are I do enjoy the servers of the Seven Chaos. I used to, like, memorize this whole thing. Servers of the Seven Chaos. Chaos is power enriched by the heart. The master is the one who unifies the chaos. Only you can do this stuff with Chaos Emeralds. It's something my grandmother taught me. I'm never to forget it. It goes like this. The servers are the seven chaos. Chaos is power. Power enriched by the heart. By the, heart. The, the controller is the one, is the one that, that unifies, unifies the, chaos. the chaos. But I'm still not sure what it all means. It means the master emerald controls the chaos emeralds. Problem solved. But the number seven is the same as the number of emeralds there are. Yes, very emeralds? good. Forgive me, but I don't think we've ever met before. I'm to call, and you are Miles Tails Power. But my friends call me Tails. Or they would if I had any friends besides that pesky hedgehog Sonic. Speaking of friends, I'm about to make a new one right here. Big the frickin' cat. If you don't believe me, just watch. There we go. Huh. Uh, take the fucking cat. Why is he a thing? Whoa! Oh my god, yikes! He almost crushed me again. Bonk. I do love how it makes the old, like, Sonic 3D blast bumper noise. Womp. And that is your only encounter with Big the Cat. Yeah, exactly. Weird. Oh well, moving on. Oh yeah, you know, the main point of the game. No biggie. This will get my tornado two up and rare to go. I don't think I have to do anything from here. I think the cutscene advances itself. I, oh no, I do. Okay. I, I have to like walk back to the workshop, I think. Hey, who left the lights on? This electricity's not cheap. Yeah, that's literally it. Now the cutscene advances itself for a little bit. The time has come at last. At last. It's only been like six this minutes. This new plane should work a lot better. Really better. I ironed out most of the problems. Turns out I was using a potato so, for a power source. Goes. That was one of the problems. Emeralds, do your stuff. 
I do enjoy Emerald Do Your Stuff. Ready, Sonic? Here I come. Here I come, Sonic. Ready to go. Woohoo. I do like this little area we never see again. This like little tails hanger that's in the waterfall with all the different tornado colors. Spoilers, it doesn't last long, the Tornado 2. But there is no Tornado 3. This is all we got. I want to say there was like a modified version of this called the Cyclone in another Sonic game. I don't know if it was Sonic Unleashed or like he has another version of the Tornado that kind of looks like this. I, I think this just goes into another cutscene. Like I think it's just a cutscene to a cutscene. Yeah, it really is. It even plays the same music again. I really don't get the point of that. Yo, whoa. There you are. Get ahead. The egg carrier. There's Sonic right at the end of uh, Red Mountain, but he hasn't hit the capsule yet, so the animals are still trapped. God damn it, Sonic. Sonic! You have to always clean up your messes. Oh, right, Tails. Way to go. This plane's cool. This plane's way past cool, man. That's the plain truth. So how's the Splatoon going? Getting any better? Now what do you say we nail those guys? I do enjoy nailing some you guys. Hang on. Sky Chase Act Two. Hey yo. Probably gonna be another one of those parts of the game that I thought took so long when I was a kid, and it's only like five minutes. When I first played this, I'm like, wow, this like part of the game goes on forever. Ba boom. Other than being blue, this plane really doesn't do anything different. Like it's, it's kind of the same thing. Ouch. Whoa. Ouch. Not supposed to see that coming. Watch out. Well, oof. Ah. Whoa. Watch out. Watch out again. Ouch. I had not played this part in a while, to be fair. Got <laughs> the giant laser. 
Here comes the giant fist. Woo! Thank you. Don't come again because he's gone, boy. He's gone. Hook the egg carrier. Now it's a boiled egg. Or something like that. 64%? What a moderate improvement. And an emblem. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. What could possibly go wrong now, as Bubsy would say? Well, let's not talk about Bubsy. We're having a good time here tonight. Coming in tight. Tails, we gotta land on the egg carrier. Uh oh. Oops. We got a problem here. What now? I forgot to put in the landing gear. What? Wow. Wow. Uh, it's been a while since the Elgato glitched, I suppose. We consider ourselves lucky we made it this far. But unfortunately, that means I gotta once again... Once again, have to reset this son of a business. Maybe not, let me see. I'm watching it. Whoa, okay. Don't get any ideas, Sonic. You have no idea what this vessel can do. I really do have no idea what it can do. But I'm guessing it ain't good. Well, hold on, we're glitching again. That's no good. That's no good. Yeah, well. It's good while it lasted. We're gonna have to do a little, uh, Elgato troubleshooting here. Just a moment. Mm. Kinda hard to miss. I never understood this part. I really was not. Yes, I'm aware the Elgato's glitching. We are going to go ahead and try and fix it. Bring it on. I do enjoy bring it on, Eggman. Like how you're just instantly transported to the friggin' sky deck entrance. Hold on. Yeah, no. <laughs> that ain't gonna work. That's not the way you do it. So what we are gonna do is, uh... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna trust that. We're gonna go ahead and play with the Elgato a little bit here. Try and fix it yet again. Only the fourth time though, which isn't bad for me. So yeah, hopefully we're all having a great night here. A little Sunday Night Sonic. The fourth such episode of the Sunday Night Sonic. Of course, we got the 50th episode of Retro coming up next Sunday at 12 p.m. Still can't believe I'm saying that. 50 episodes. In just three short years. Hey, what can I say? I like what I do. You gotta like what you do. You know, if you're doing something like this. It's a, it's a you know, passion project. That's the word I was looking for. Alright, this should work now, maybe. Possibly. We'll see. Maybe not. Maybe so. Ah, I don't really know. Alright. Uh, there we go. So, this must be the sky deck, It huh? really is. Can be a little bit of a difficult level, but... I have some faith in my ability to make it through. Hey, ah! I do enjoy... Uh, Come on, the checkpoint, like, right at the beginning of the level. It's almost a little tricky, because you got to stay ahead of Sonic, but you also don't want to fall off the stage. And yes, I know I can fly. You made it. I really do.
Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm just gonna let it. I'm just gonna let him die. Sorry, Tails. You made it. I really didn't make it. Although he's like really kicking up fast. It's hiking guy Bobby. What's going on, man? It's uh, wrestling fan Randy. How you doing tonight? Checking in. Got ourselves a little Sonic adventure tonight. All right, now it's actually more of a Tails adventure, but uh, nonetheless, we appreciate you joining the show. It's Randy. I'm good. I hope you are good as well. We got Retro 50 coming up next Sunday. We got a little Sunday Night Sonic coming up right now. Never seen this? That's hard to believe, considering how often I play this game. Maybe you've never seen Tales Story, but... Yeah, this is Sonic Adventure, one of my favorite games of all time, and we are just checking it all out here. Almost done with this story. Depending on how much time we have, we may or may not check out Knuckles' story afterwards. Also an intriguing story of sorts. Yeah! Yeah! Is that it? Sonic, we should check out the bridge. I do enjoy Retromania 50. Do enjoy checking out the bridge. As I then proceed to not check it out at all and just go up to the top floor. Uh, the only clue I can say is that it's coming out September 25th at uh, 12 p.m. It's going to be a lot of special features. It should be fun. Although I'm not really sure what you want to know. Sonic! Tails! That's us. You're a bit late. Not the oh no, not the birdie. Anything but the birdie. What are we gonna do? It's a mystery. Oh, hold on. Yo, God, was glitching again. Oh, lordy. Do I have to fight Gamma as him? Yeah, I'm aware. I've had to deal with this a few times. Let me see if I can fix it real quick here. Ow. Alright. Oh, it's like the sixth or seventh time this has happened. Really, it's time to give them all you got. Now, Gamma has one of the more interesting stories in the entire series. E-102 Gamma, that is. The one that we just saw there, the robot. Let's see if this works at all. Oh, you do fight him as a Tails. I actually didn't know that. I mean, I knew it, but it's just been a while. Oh, well. Gives us a little more time to talk. A little more talking time. Sorry, I came in. No, nah, it's fine. It's not you. It's been doing that, like, the entire stream, basically. Uh, probably something to do with the Dreamcast, because last time I did this was on the Sonic Adventure 2 stream, which is another Dreamcast game. Ow. Please stop, Tails. Move aside, Amy. Time for another touchy feely moment. No. This robot is my friend. He really is. He, he really me. did. Don't hurt him. Hmm. All right, fine. Okay, if you say so, you have your reasons, I guess. All right, fine. Tails is convinced. Oh, shit. Oh, the whole ship's losing altitude. Hey, ship losing That's altitude. what I just said. Thank you, Tails. Thank you for just adding to what's already going on. Amy and get out of here. Well, what about you? I'll 
find Eggman and put a stop to his evil ways. I do enjoy putting a stop to her butt in its evil ways. Yeah, trying to fly Amy out of there. How Tails was able to do this without tiring out is beyond me. Time for some semi-decent looking explosions for a 1999 game. Hey, who knows? Maybe we'll see this game for uh, Retromania. Hmm, what could possibly go wrong now? Look at that, Tails is fine. So is Amy. All is right with the world. And that random bird. You gotta have a random bird. Whoa. Oh. A robotic just happens to crash. The whole timeline of this makes no sense. This part of the game actually takes place after Sonic's already beaten Robotnik's Egg Viper. That's Pretty Eggman. sure. I wonder what happened to Sonic. Actually, maybe not. I'm finished. Chaos was defeated, and now my egg carrier is ruined. No matter. I will destroy Station Square anyway. I do love how this was actually a plan, and like Robotnik didn't just go with this from the beginning. Like, he already had a plan to destroy Station Square with a missile, but he went through all this stuff with chaos. If that missile is launched... Ready? Fire! Tails like, what row? Ooh, shite. Oh, the rumble feature definitely works. And nothing happens. Oh, no, it was a dud. I do hate when it's a dud. I can't believe this. No way, I can't I'm believe this. Deal with this myself. Oh no! Oh, no. I There's a lot of people with the oh, a few people. A couple a couple of Johns. Actually, his friend Saki, who you might know. A good time was had by most. Well, time for Tails to do his thing. See if we can beat Robotnik in a head-to-head -head race. Eggman. The fate of Station Square depends on me. <sighs> Sonic! Oh, stop with Sonic. I've changed a lot since I've started hanging hey, with Sonic. Hey, you got a lot more pathetic. But I can't depend on him forever. You really cannot. I know I can do this by myself. Alright, fine. Okay, Eggman. Alright, let's go. I do enjoy this level, I will say. I mean, I prefer Sonic's version, but this level is pretty iconic. Speed Highway versus Robotnik. Let's go. You think you can keep up with me? I really might not be able to. Oh, it's fun. You'll never defeat me. I really am gonna defeat him. What? He's got he up. really has. Oh shit. I'm dead. Oh, well, it's the end of that. You think you can keep up with me? Maybe. You'll never defeat me. I really might. What? He's I really have. I've got you now. He really does. Goodbye. 
Oh, enough out of that. God damn it, he really is going to take the whole city with him. Shoot. No, 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 no. I'm going to die. I'm actually running out of lives here. You think you can keep up with me? try. You'll never defeat me. I really me. might. What? He's I'm trying. Tails I really am not waiting for you, Robotnik. I've got you now. I really don't. You little fox. You're just technically ahead, though. Whoa, okay. Oh, that's much needed. Let's go. I really have caught up. Come on, Robotnik. Coming for you. Ah, oh, it's glitching again. I've got you now, Taste. All right, hold on. Once again, we have to deal with the curse of the janky Elgato. A curse that I'm all too familiar with, unfortunately. So let's uh, see here. A couple ways I can do this. Doesn't seem to really matter which one I do. Just yeah, it's not. That's not good. Not a problem. I mean, slight, slight problem, but not not a big problem. Literally a very minor setback, if you will. Speed highway has now turned into lag highway. Hey, but we got this. We gonna do this. It'll be fine. Okay, what do we got? We got it back. Looks like we got it back. All right, all right. How about you, Randy? Do anything fun this weekend? Oh, really? I just reset this. Alright, hold on. We're gonna have to try this the other, other way. It's so ridiculous how I have to keep doing this. Oh, there we go. Like, some nights are just better than others. I have no idea what's causing this tonight, but it's all good. We got ourselves, we got some good times being had by all, regardless of the touchy Elgato action, as it were. So, I appreciate everybody checking out the stream tonight. We still got some more to go, hopefully. Uh, Elgato Game Capture. Let me go ahead and try this. Playing around with it. Basically trying the old unplug it and plug it back in tactic. Surprisingly effective sometimes. Yeah, well, no biggie. I've come to expect this, unfortunately. Shouldn't have to, but I do. Hey, there we go. How about now? How's about now? Sunday night problems. Well, yeah, that could be something. Oh, crap. Another problem is Robotnik is ahead. Oh, we gotta catch up to Robotnik. Tails, wait for me! Alright, fine. I'm really not gonna wait for you. Besides, he's ahead. Why is he telling me to wait for him? I'll take that whole city. Really with better me. not do that. What? He's I really down. have. Actually, I have it according to the map. Alright, this is like the big finale here. You little fox. You little fox. Woo! Get him! Wow, what a comeback. What a comeback. I did not think I had a shot there. Nicely played. That wasn't too bad. It was all right. Hey, I found the missile before Robotnik. I don't know what else I can do. Now we just have to take on the final boss, and we'll see what happens from there.
Hell. It's like the end of the line for you, Robotnik. Oh no! It's Robotnik! So you beat me to the missile, you little pest. Oh no, it's Robotnik! I will make you all pay for I this. I just hate when he makes us all pay, and I also don't know where all these people go during this part. Oh, this is it. The egg walker. Again, if he had you this thing like ready to go, why is he doing all this other stuff? Before I make mince meat out of you. Uh-oh. I'm not scared. I'm a little scared. I'm not scared. I might be a little scared. I can do right, this. Fine. Let's go. Final boss's tails. See if he can prove his worthiness as anything other than a sidekick. Whoa, bombs. Get a load of this. No way. I can't believe this. I can believe it. Whoa. What kind of weird hit was that? Whoa. Get a load at get a load at this. No way. I can't believe it. Ah. I say it should only be like one hit left. He's not going to get away with this. I really might get away with it. You were a bot, Nick. He's not going to get away with it. I remember I always used to have, like, these dialogues when I played this as a kid. Like, I would actually, like, talk back to the characters. I'm like, no, you're done, Robotnik. Like, it'd be this whole freaking thing. Ow. No way. I can't believe this. Dead. Game beaten. Game, set, match, Robotnik. Trying to take out the trash. In this scenario, a box of trash. In case you guys didn't know. So yeah, that was Tail's story. We're going to go ahead and enjoy the ending here. Thank you for uh, sticking that out with me. A little Sunday Night Sonic action. We still got a little bit to go. Hey, I did it. You really did do it. You saved the day. Ooh, generic pedestrians. Some random black guy. You did all right. I appreciate the stream. Oh, I appreciate you watching. We may or may not be done yet. I haven't yet determined if I'm going to play Knuckles Story, but either way, I'm enjoying the uh, action tonight. A little Sunday Night Sonic to celebrate the great month of September. We got October not too far behind. We got Retro 50 coming up on September 25th. We got Tails celebrating his ass off. With both tails. Sonic not even saying anything. He's just like, yeah, you do this, you do you. Nice little moment here with Sonic and Tails celebrating together. I actually was never a big fan of Tails' theme song in this, but whatever. It is what it ain't. See, that's what I mean. Like, you can beat Tails' story in like not even an hour and a half. That's with me pausing to fix the Elgato every 10 minutes. I have no idea what he's mouthing there. And then we're going to do the, like, the little jump into the camera there, celebration type of deal. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, that was uh, Tales Story, uh, Sonic Adventure, Sega Dreamcast. Just uh, rolling the credits right now, make cut back and forth between those. But uh, what do you guys think? Hopefully enjoying the stream, enjoying this story. 
all that good stuff. Beam cast rocks. Well, that is true. That is definitely true. We might see some more of this special console on Retro 50. Uh, my favorite console of all time, of course, the Sega Dreamcast. That is something that uh, will never change. You never know. Oh, I know. Yeah, I probably will wrap it up after this. Uh, after the credits, will. Yeah, great credits. Sarah, good credit. I gotta give him credit for the credits. Yeah, no, I'll probably wrap it up after this. I was thinking about doing Knuckles' story, but that's like another hour and a half, and I'm, I'm pretty deep. And, uh, hiked about a mile and a half today, maybe a little longer. And, uh, yeah, I, I enjoy streaming. I like streaming at night. I also like streaming in the morning. I like streaming just about any time. But, you know, even. Even the great ones have their limits, but I will let this credit thing play out so we can, we can chat during the credits. There's no post credit scene or anything. I'm all right. I do what I can. You're not too bad yourself, Randy. Now we're just seeing all the people that worked on the game along with different cutscenes from said game. Of course, I did stream Sonic Story a long, long time ago. Sonic Story and Sonic Adventure, that is. And like I said, I thought there'd be more people on. Well, yeah, you know, it's a Sunday night. People are doing stuff. People playing games, doing whatever. But, you know, it's all fun. It's all good. It's all fun and games until somebody, I don't know, does something. So someone takes an eye out, I don't know. Not a bad little guitar solo here. And you want to play games? Yeah, well, I mean, I like to play some games. I've actually been getting into uh, Fall Guys lately, just this really kooky, crazy game that I'll probably be streaming sometime soon. But uh, I digress. Playing games is what it's all about here on the channel. And at this point, if the stream starts to skip, I'm not even going to worry about it because we're just watching credits. I've seen Fall Guys. Oh, Fall Guys is great. Like, I mean, I always thought it was kind of just a goofy little gimmick, and it is, but the randomness and just the, the chaotic nature of it, absolutely perfect for what I go for. So, that might be getting added to the fold pretty soon. Along with Rocket League, Mutant, Mutant League football, all the crazy off-the-wall sports games I play. I don't know why, but I do. My friend Nightmare 10 plays it a lot. Who's Nightmare 10? I don't know, but that, that's kind of cool. It's a cool name. I like the way they spell Nightmare. Yeah, I just started getting into it. All right. Finito. Fin. The finale, if you will. It was a fun one. But yeah, that is Sonic Adventure on the Sega Dreamcast. Follow him on Twitch. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Just have to remember that name. It's hard to forget. But uh, yeah, that was uh, Sonic Adventure on the Dreamcast. Playing Tail Story, beating Robotnik, taking, taking down the bad guy, saving the day. But, you know, just another day in the life of... Uh, Chaos Blur, Bobby Gaines. Uh, feel free to follow me on Twitter if you don't already at Chaos underscore Blur. I am going through all the different retros in history and kind of just summarizing them on Twitter as we get ready for Retro 50, which is coming very soon. But for right now, I'm signing off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay chaotic and blur out.